My name is Bri Samir and I'm a visual artist based in Manila. The exhibition is called Untitled Blankets, which held at Art Informal Gallery in 2019. The exhibition Untitled Blankets seeks to be an inquiry on spaces, those of which we share and inhabit. I wanted to explore the ever-changing landscape of my community by recording my surroundings. It is a collection of sentiment, speculation, and sound. It has grown to become an archive of both the material and the cerebral, the physical space and its structures, and my instinctive and personal relationship with it. Using primarily paper and textile, I explored ways of mark making, documenting the shifting life in the informal community where I live. Informal communities around the Philippines remain to live under precarity due to threats of demolition and displacement. This anxious ephemerality is a concept that this exhibit attempts to inspect. The textures and shapes present abstract evidence of developmental aggression experienced by my community. Commercialization and corporate land grabbing, the works themselves display the same aggression through the process of tearing paper with my hands, manipulating the medium in various and layered states of scotch by incorporating dust, muck, debris, and other irregular and informal ways of printing, of leaving marks. The process of embroidery and sewing that I have incorporated in my works is a testament to attempts in repairing. To repair is to make something new again, to make something useful out of the often forgotten and discarded. This is something that I have found parallel in my everyday life in my community. In walks and bike rides I have taken, I have taken particular notice to structures like awning. Awning, or more commonly known as overhangs, are primarily built to protect homes from heavy rains and direct sunlight. In the Philippines, this is often built with recycled tarpaulin. It is also in itself a sort of repair, making use of objects past its original function and made new. I look at awnings as blankets, blankets for homes, blankets often associated with warmth and comfort. These overhang structures deliver the same kind of refuge as blankets. The process of embroidery and sewing for me has also become a form of introspection, a way for me to get in touch with my internal space. A space I have discovered reacts directly to the physical space I inhabit. In contrast to this physical state of anxiety are the colors that I chose to marry into my works. The colors bright and sweet set out to exhibit thriving life. This striving is not accidental but a practice in struggling. It is a practice in reclaiming. In line with this striving, I have grown fond of invasive plants and like the people in my community, they have found ways to confront being unwelcome. Though invasiveness is the strong way to look at lives and communities, for they are neither intruding or presumptuous, they have the right to fair and livable homes. This is what I mean when I say I seek to reclaim. I want to interrogate spaces that society has deemed me, my family and my community uninvited in. I don't look at my works as my paintings, but paintings of my environment by my environment. I am in this exhibition an observer above anything. Untitled Blankets is not meant to be an exercise in romance, it is simply a study in seeing and feeling. Untitled is simply to be without title, like those who live in my community without proof of ownership, and together, under the blanket of care, togetherness, and hope, we reclaim our space. Here in the modesty of the exhibition, you are welcome, we all are.